Greetings, Great Witch here. Today we're going to talk about the Ubermox Zion Classic. Now this vehicle is going to set you back $812,000, but for an additional $385,000 you can fully upgrade and customize this vehicle. Now this vehicle is a sports classic and it is based on the first gen BMW M6. Now there's a, quite a few things that you can do to this car and there's lots of stuff in each of the categories. So once you get in there, you can start playing around and make this car look pretty cool. There's a lot of different ways to set it up. And some of the uh, liveries are actually really cool. And there's one, the robot bubblegum one, actually puts one of those pillows in the back, you know, one of the girlfriend pillows. So you can have all kinds of fun with this car. So it being a sports classic, there's some, a lot of stuff you can do to it. There's lots of cool liveries. Cosmetically, I dig this car. I think it's pretty cool. It's kind of expensive, 800 and some thousand dollars, you know, getting close to a million once you fully upgrade it. So for a sports classic, most people don't race those. They kind of just sit in the garage, so I'm not sure if I will actually keep this one, but cosmetically, I dig it. Now the performance of this vehicle, it has some issues. It is a sports classic, so it's basically like a muscle car. And one of the main things about this car is it's very springy in the suspension. Now I tried lowering the suspension a couple times, you know, doing down one notch at a time, and it didn't really get rid of it. I mean, you can slam it down to the ground, but it's still, it makes it real slidey once you do that. But all in all, it's a decent performing car for what it is. And other than that, it's not something that I feel that I would keep. It does do, you know, really good speeds, got some good acceleration, good torque, stuff like that. Brakes are even decent. It's just real bouncy, and I don't know, I just, it feels like it's almost being pushed down from the top. That's just kind of the way that it feels to me. I don't know, it's just kind of weird. But I'm not going to keep this one. All right, well, this is Grey Witch. I hope this video helps you out. I will see you next time. Peace!